of the best defenses in all of the country. Early on, we're trying to see how do they play this on the outside. Little play action. Trying to step up in the grasp and down goes Harris. Shaquille Brown, the senior from Tallahassee with the sack. The Dow, their leading rusher, he had over 1,000 yards on the ground, nine touchdowns, a couple of games of over 200 yards rushing. They'll throw it here, and Johnson makes up for the drop. First down, out across the 30 for Rajay. Hauled down by Trey Moore. You already know, we're in Orlando, but we could probably call it Yak City. And I say Yak City for a reason, yards after catch. This is what this offense has been all about, the big play. It's an easy throw. Head coach is a former high school coach in the state of Texas. Yeah. I think he's a little biased <laughs> on what he thinks are the best football players, right? Oh, we got a bad snap. And on third down, Gunnar Watson and Jake that. Andrews. By rule, that's a safety. And the safety out of the back of the end zone. And it's, believe it or not, the UTSA defense that gets the first points on the board. This game was about who's going to make the first mistake this time. Gunnar Watson looking over at the sideline, waiting for the play call to come in. And the center, Jake Andrews, one of the all-conference guys, snaps the, game the football. To three, five, eight. Looking to throw is Harris. Caught. Touchdown. Zakari Franklin. His 15th touchdown catch of the year. I want you to watch Franklin. He's going to come from the left side of the screen. He just gets lost behind the linebackers. Everyone's doing what? They've got their eyes on Frank here. Second and one here. Watson. Under duress and down he goes. It's the emerging star, Trey Moore, with the sack and a loss of six. But you mentioned the 2-1-0 triangle toughness. Physical, tough, strong. Number 31 right there in the middle, Trey Moore. Plenty of leg and he's got it. Quarterback formerly of Pittsburgh or Pitt University. The Here fake we go slide. for Watson. Under duress and he's hammered and down he goes. Tremaine Bell with their third sack of the half. The end goes inside up top. The end goes inside, and the tackle loops around. Tremaine Bell with the loop. The tackle, Stidham doesn't pick him up. Billingsley breaks free. First time across midfield today on a drive aided by 23 yards and penalties. 31, Trey Moore, watch, he's going to come on the inside. You got to stay outside if you're the defensive end. See how he went inside? There was nobody there. No. Play action, another sack, number four on the day. This time it's Jamal Ligon. Uh, he's the eraser, he's the eliminator. <laughs> you better find number eight because this is what he does. That's two guys available for him. And just a relentlessness to the quarterback. He comes unblocked for the sack on Watson. Troy says, hey, we'll take, we'll take advantage of all these penalties on this drive and keep it alive. First and goal. Right up the middle and in. Touchdown, Kamani Vidal. This is big boy football. This is what Troy's been all season long, trying to win the line of scrimmage. Just push, keep those legs churning. You get the ball to start the second half, you're UTSA. It's a big second down for UTSA. The drop eight. And it's intercepted. Picked off at the 30. Richard Juvenor. Inside the 20-yard line. And look at this for the Trojans D. Here's, here's a look at the interception again. Yeah, Harris just trying to get it over the top, but Juvenor is right there. He just grabs that football and he turns into a wide receiver. And always, it's, all, it's the hits, especially the hits to the quarterback. Blitz coming, it's picked up. Man coverage into the end zone and intercepted. Kalechi Wachuku with the pick in the end zone. And this is all what they preach, 2-1-0. Physical, tough, strong. And the more physical person, the more physical guy, the more stronger guy, all of the above, takes that football away. Just the extension by Wachuku. Sack for Troy and Richard Juvenor. 
And our condolences to Jeff and his family, the loss of his father, Billy, on Monday. He passed away. And after a first down throw, is this a, a strip for Troy to get the turnover? Yeah, it was forward progress already stopped. And it seemed that the official were already calling the play dead. But if they let it play on, that's a fumble going over to Troy. Sean Swanson taking it away from Cardenas. And that's just will and want to. Just getting a hand in there. You know, I like to call it the old uh, lawnmower, right, Beth? Start that lawnmower. Get your hand in there and just rip it out. That's a tremendous job by Troy. And Cardenas trying not to go down. Well, they're getting the takeaways, but just one score off those takeaways, and the response from the Roadrunners is a sack for Corey Mayfield. Still got over nine minutes to go in the third. And the defenses have owned the day, and there's a first down throw, and then the hurdle out to the 46 for Dan Dishman. <laughs> Harris, the Conference USA MVP, is picked off at the three-yard line. K.J. Robertson on the run. Blockers in front. He's across midfield and still going. All the way down to the 37-yard line. 61 yards on the return. He's staring down where he wants to go. Watch number seven. See, he's looking at the quarterback, and that ball is right there. Just watching the quarterback's eyes as he tried to get the ball to Cardenas. Cardenas, the, the tight end, but a good job by the linebacker reading the quarterback's eyes. Watson, play action to the end zone, touchdown! Rajay Johnson from 12 yards out for the lead. This is Gunnar Watson's best throw of the night. He's going to thread the needle. You can't cover it any better if you're Mayfield, the corner. He's right there on it, but the ball's already delivered. Watson, end zone. Catch is made. Touchdown. The uh, two-point conversion is good as the receiver was falling out of the end zone. Minimum is on the side of Troy. The throw is right there, and he goes up and grabs it. Looking for the six-point advantage. And he's got it. Saw it again, run on first. See if they go with the pass or hand it back off. They'll run it. Big burst. Barnes gets the edge. Foot race inside the 25 for 10 and down to the five-yard line. First and goal, road runners. It's about vision, though. It's the vision of Barnes be, to be able to get all the way to the backside. Everybody thought he was going front. Watson, pressure coming. And down he goes. Back at the 25-yard line. Taylor and Evans got to him, and there's a flag as well. Kick is away. Carpenter will give it a go. Catches inside the 20. And out to the 30-yard line for Frank Harris and one of the most potent offenses in college football this year. Two minutes. Harris has to throw it away, and it will come down to one play. I think Harris is upset. He felt like he got hit out of bounds. He was throwing that football away, and he thought he got hit by a defender, but there was no call. Well, last time on fourth down, down by the goal line, they went to the fade to Franklin. Fourth and nine here. This is your ball game right here. Cardenas has been the guy, number nine in the slot. Harris. Broken up at the 10-yard line. Intended for Franklin, and Stewart had the coverage. Best receiver against the best DB, and Troy wins that one.
Franklin had a step. We'll watch the recovery speed by Reddy Stewart. He's there. Plays right through the hands of Franklin. Terrific job playing through the hands. Knocking that ball away. And Troy ending this game how they've done so many times this season with their defense. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.